What's up, everyone? Welcome to another edition of Theron's Thoughts. My name is Theron Shetty. These are my thoughts. Hope you guys are doing well. I'm doing fantastic. It's uh, Friday. Happy Friday, everyone. This is what we're all waiting for, right? Friday. I mean, this is the weekend. I mean, it's all the same shit to me, to be honest with you. But, you know, everything's fine and dandy here in West Hollywood. I'm just trucking along, people. Yesterday, I went to an open mic with my friend Elliot in Burbank. My God, I tanked it for like five minutes. He warned me. He goes, this crowd's a little woke, which means kind of progressive. And I go on stage and I was like, uh, so I was dating this chick. And I said chick and the whole crowd goes, whoa. And I knew I was in trouble. But hey, you know, that's L.A. comedy. Maybe I've spent too much time in Florida and that's OK. I just um, I got some more shows coming up. Uh, only a few more, but I'll put that on my Instagram. And if you're in LA, you can come out and boo me. I don't care. It's fine. And I'm um, trying to just move, right? And keep inner peace. I think a lot of, for me anyways, it's the in-between time. Like when you work a job, you're always working, right? And you want to find that free time to work on your creative projects. But if you have all the time in the world to do your creative stuff, then you start to go insane. You're like, dude, now what do I do? I already wrote for like three hours and then I'm kind of burned out. Then what do you do? You like go on YouTube and go for walks? I mean, there's only so many walks you can make. I also have like a small group of friends who don't work in entertainment. They work in like health insurance and stuff like that. And these guys kill it. And the reason I love hanging out with these uh, people is because one they're infinite they're infinitely successful which is inspiring for me but it's just good to hang out with people who are not in showbiz and it's so funny because my comedy friends like they're just kind of you know they're always going spot to spot and these guys like they're taking you know summer vacations in london dichotomy of two different worlds so uh, I feel very blessed that I'm able to go back and forth, but the Indian side of me definitely craves <laughs> the more luxurious side, right? The the entertainment side, like you, you pretty much are successful when you made it. Um, but you got to enjoy the journey too, right? Like why why go through anything if you don't enjoy the journey of it? So I try to tell myself that I'm like, Theron, try to enjoy. <laughs> the process, the daily process, especially now. I mean, I should only be doing stuff that I actually enjoy doing, like comedy or writing. Like, I'm not gonna, like my my brother asked me, he goes, hey, are you gonna do more print stuff? And I'm like, no, I'm kind of miserable doing print stuff. I mean, I could definitely use the money, I mean, while I'm here, but I'm not gonna chase it uh, in terms of, you know, Trying to get an agent, trying to audition, trying to, I mean, that's such a whole rigmarole of trying to, you know, get these auditions and book them. And honestly, I don't even feel that healthy or I don't, I don't feel like I look good even. Like I'm very insecure right now about, about everything. But, you know, but I also told somebody, you know, the fact that like I let my hair kind of just go, like it's kind of freeing, like not having to worry about, you know, what's happening to me, like my weight, like my cut, like all this bullshit, which is just, man, it gets to you after decades. <laughs> it really does get to you, you know, trying to hold on to your youth. And uh, I'm trying to be graceful as I get older. And I don't know if I'm actually doing that properly. Uh, I think I have a lot of baggage, obviously. But, um, you know, every day is a process. And these daily walks really help. I highly suggest that if, if you're, if you're, you know, trying to get active and be exercise more, just go for a walk. I mean, that's what I do. I mean, I'm not like super fat. I watch what I eat, but I've been going for these long walks and I'm a guy who used to work out like every day, like with weights and, you know, jujitsu and all this nonsense. And now I'm just going for walks like an old man. And I feel great. Like there's something about just walking outside for an hour, hour and a half and just putting on the headphones. Uh, it helps me mentally anyways. But I don't know. That's pretty much it. I got nothing else. I hope you guys are doing well. Uh, I've purposely not made any plans for this weekend. I'm just going to buckle down and, and uh, you know, do my writing stuff. 
I'm working on a manifesto that I'm going to send to the New York Times. <laughs> no, I'm just doing ridiculous things here. I hope you guys have a great weekend. We'll talk soon. Take care.